Hi, it's Mona McClellan, and you typed in how to build self-confidence in a child. And wow, doesn't every parent want to know that? I know when I had children, I was like a deer in the headlights. You know, they say, you know, you should have a manual, and you really should. But here are some of the things I learned along the way. My children, my oldest is 24, and I still have one who's 11, and there is five altogether. So here's what I have learned. Um, also, I am a life and health coach, and I'm going to tell you that most of these things also pertain to adults. So if you are listening to this, you can apply these things to yourself as well, and they will really help you and your self-confidence and self-esteem. So first of all, give your children choices. You know, make them age-specific. But if they want to be able to do something, they have to know if you choose this, this is what will happen, or if you choose this, this will happen, that every choice comes with a consequence, and then help them discern which is the right choice for them. Um, get them to help around the house. They feel really good when they're helping. Again, make it task-specific that they can do, setting the table, you know, clearing the table, putting the compost out, those kinds of things, and, and thank them, because when we do things, we like to be thanked as well. Encourage them in their, in their personal interests. So if they are talented in something or they are interested in trying something, and encourage it and figure out a way that you can help make that happen. And um, help them to see it through. This will give them a sense of accomplishment. I mean, if they hate it and they're kicking and screaming, you might have to rethink it and, again, give them choices. But if you encourage them to see it through, this will help a lot with accomplishment. I know when I was a kid, I don't think my parents, after four kids, had it in them. Just if I didn't want to do something, they go, okay. And I had to really, you know, that was part of my self-esteem, and um, that needed to be tended to. And I had to really work on that as an adult. So help them with that as when they're children. It will go a long way. Um, I did mention about goals. Um, setting goals with kids is really important, but you want to make sure that they're attainable and reachable. Um, the same for for adults as well, because sometimes we bite off more than we can chew and we just give up. Kids will do the same. And appropriate amount of praise. Overpraising doesn't really do children any good. They just kind of goes in one ear and out the other. They don't think it's sincere. And um, so appropriate praise. And be specific rather than just saying, good work. Um, tell them what they, you thought they did a good job on and why you thought about thought that. And that will really help them um, in, a, in a specific way and as they're going forward feel good about that skill that they did because you commented on it and they'll do it again. So those are some tips that can help you build self-confidence in a child and in yourself. And, you know, doing things that you love is really important and helping people, for me, is one of the things that really makes me feel good and helps my confidence and self-esteem. And if you're trying to figure out um, something that you need to do for yourself or for your child, you have to really ask yourself, you know, how important is this to me? And for example, it was very important for me to stay at home and be with my children and work from home. And I also wanted to be able to be flexible with my time. So I took my coaching services and I sort of transformed them into an internet business. And I teamed up with um, some folks on the internet who are brilliant and taught me exactly what they do so I can help others and I can also make money and save money for my family at the same time. Now I know that you'll be curious about that. So what you need to do is go to my website heresanotherway.com or click on the button below. You know I really believe that having a parent at home goes a long way to helping you know, raise children, their self-confidence and their self-esteem. And if you feel the same way that I do, you might want to do what I'm doing so you can be there. Again, you know, go to the button below this video, click on it, and, well, you can thank me later.